Hello YouTube, this is Beedrew1111, Gamertag Beedrew93, the Welsh Gamer. Uh, the Welsh Gamer is speaking, and um, yeah, th this is a very spontaneous video. Um, I, w I was literally just on the on the, in the chat with one of my mates, and uh, we were just chatting away, and I just it just I, I just felt instantly inspired to put out this video, and basically, the video is titled "What It Is," simply because, wow, is all I have left to say. Wow, um, Division is a phenomenal game. Um, I, I've already put. Uh, uh, well, I say already put. I mean, I got it. I got it yesterday. Downloaded it last night. I played on it all night. I've put about maybe eight hours in, or, or something like that. Like, like, and and I, I got up dead early this morning to play on it again. Um, it, it's absolutely amazing. Um, but the th the reason, the reason I wanted to make this video is because something just occurred to me, like quite rapidly. Um, and that is how the importance of co-op. Now, I know I know people probably think, well, well that's obvious, blah, blah 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 blah. But like, I think what Ubisoft have done correct with this game over everything is is the co-op, uh, the multiplayer aspect, the, the openness, the, the the fact you can just jump in and out with friends. This is what the new gen should be about. This is the standard that we should be seeing all the time. And it is so evident because, like, think about it. The Division hasn't even been out a week yet, at least I think, like, you know, a week. We'll just say a week, right? I can't, I can't remember the exact date. But it's all people are talking about. It's all people are talking about. It's all people are playing. It's all people are talking about, all people are playing, and it, that is simply because it is just an open spectrum, heavy co-op, social, and ev like, like everyone who appreciates games and plays and wants to be in this new generation of gaming can experience it together. And it's such a passionate thing I got going, like, 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 like it's like... It's getting me really excited. The more I play this game, the more I'm thinking, wow, God, the possibilities. And the reason I say this is because take a game like Far Cry Primal, for a perfect example. And I'm not going to sit here and say it's a bad game, because one, I haven't played it, and two, it looks a good game, and I'll probably play it eventually. So I'm not saying it's a bad game. But nobody's talking about it. And that is simply because when you weigh it up, What's the more approachable game, and for what particular reason? Like, and I'm a huge Far Cry fan. I've played nearly every Far Cry there is, and I love Far Cry. And Far Cry 4 was phenomenal. I loved it, and the best, one of the best, better parts about it, even though it got repetitive because they didn't really invest the time into it. But I loved the, the two-player co-op. Me and my mate taking on um, like outposts and stuff. Brilliant. And if you remember, I'd done a video before about Far Cry Primal, where I basically done a video with all the things that they needed to make this game better than the last. And they failed in that front, in my personal opinion. Um, you know, who knows? I might be playing. I might have been playing Far Cry Primal over the division if they'd done it differently. But they didn't. They stripped it of co-op. They made it single player only. And no doubt, it's a good game. But nobody's talking about it. It's not. It's not absolutely storming the bloody gaming market as we speak. The division is. And yes, you can put it down to like the hype over the last four years and the alpha and people talking about it and how it's just become like the next Destiny, which is also another hype train people are jumping on. Um, not that I'd know because I never played Destiny neither, but still, ultimately, the groundbreaking factor which makes this game phenomenal and above games like Primal, who that has been that has come out within the same sort of you know um, spec, you know, same sort of time, is the fact that it's co-op sociable and you and your friends can play together and that is ultimately what everyone wants i know for a fact that that's what me and my friends want with any game they should make this the standard for any game this is what people developers need to look at and think right this is what makes a game successful and i know we're going to see a lot more games like this um like uh, with ghost recon um uh, Wildlands, I think it's called, and then you've got like Rainbow Six Siege, which came out the other week, and you know, and I know more and more games are hopefully going to go down this route, but I just needed to do a video, hopefully as brief as possible. I'll try to keep it as brief, but just to make the point that this is what developers need to do to for games to be like absolutely spot on. The Division, I've been on it, we'll say eight hours now, 
and it's one of those games which like I can imagine I could put another hundred hours into especially with friends even people I don't know I'm jumping into missions with random people and I'm having the best time last night I was online with Darian uh, Darian is king and we were having an awesome time. It was actually the first time I ever gamed with him, funnily enough. But we collaborated over the division, and we we got you know we got chatting. It's the first time we've properly spoke, um, and all because of a game. Which end of the day, if it didn't have ex if it didn't have um, community or sociable um, you know factors like you know the co-op, who knows? I might not even be playing this game. It's, it's absolutely fantastic, and I just needed to throw that out there. And this isn't so much a video just about The Division, it's just a video making the point that this is the sort of thing that gamers, gaming needs to, this is the direction gaming needs to go for this generation and beyond. The Division is a milestone, and I'm thoroughly enjoying it. And it is mainly above everything else because of the co-op sociable multiplayer factor, and this is what games need to be doing. Right guys, I'll end it there, but that's uh, something I had to get off my chest. I had to say it because I've been saying it for ages and the news when Far Cry Primal came out um, that it wasn't going to be co-op hit me hard. I was gutted um, and it's for this reason because games need it. It's, it's, a, it's a must and this is proof of that, why it's so successful. Because everyone's talking about The Division and you don't really hear anyone talking about these you know, other games that are single player. I mean... Dare I say it, as much as I'm looking forward to Quantum Break, I can imagine that game being talked about for like a few weeks and then sort of shelved because it hasn't got a multiplayer, it hasn't got a co-op. People will probably be talking about The Division again. You know, end of the day, certain things speak absolute volumes and the fact that you can play with your friends goes above everything in my opinion. Take the graphics away, take take a lot of things away. Like, it's not even the best graphics game I've ever played. It's beautiful, but it's not the best graphically. It's not the best gameplay. It's not, overall, the most groundbreaking game I've ever played. But because the sociable side of it is so good, it just speaks volumes. It makes the whole game, all round, a great game. That's, that's just my opinion, but I do believe I speak for a lot of people when I say this. But anyway, take it easy, guys. That's The Welsh Gamer. Out.